Hello, I am Ajay Ramesh. And I am Nitin Raj from the International Institute of Information Technology, Bangalore. And we are here to present a tactile audio gallery for visually impaired students. So at present, visually impaired students find it hard to comprehend and uh, perceive visual uh, information in form of images or graphics. So what's available to them are these kinds of tactile diagrams, which are basically embossed images from textbooks itself. So what they do right now is they feel around the diagram and they read the braille text corresponding to it. So they have to go to and fro between the diagram and the braille, which can be a bit tiresome and time consuming. So this is exactly the challenge we wish to address with the tactile audio gallery. It's a low cost, compact and robust tactile to audio conversion device uh, with, with, we recognize the model that's been placed on the platform and, we, uh, and based on user touch, we deliver relevant audio information. The device has features which enhance the learning experience and also makes it as easy as possible for self-use by the visually impaired students using low-cost sensor design and sensor integration techniques. Compared to other devices out there, the tactile audio gallery is low-cost it does not require any computer literacy and also it uh, does not require other devices for its functionality. This is an example of a tactile diagram depicting different parts of a plant. This diagram can now be placed on the platform and studied. Device is in short mode. This diagram depicts the different parts of a plant. So, the, de the device operates in two modes, the short and the long mode. Initially, the short mode is activated. The short mode delivers only concise information about each of the labels. Roots, leaf attached to the stem, sun rays. Once the, once the visually impaired student gets an idea of how many labels are present in the diagram as well as how they are spatially located, they can move on to the long mode which delivers more detailed information about each of the labels. Device is in long mode. This diagram depicts different parts of a plant. The leaves are the primary site of photosynthesis. They manufacture food for the plants. The flower is the reproductive part of the plant. The ovary of the flower develops into fruits containing seeds. Once a student is done with studying one diagram, they can very easily move on to the next. Device is in long mode. This diagram depicts the structure of the human respiratory system. The rib cage lies in the chest area. It protects the wind pipe connects the nose to the lung. As you could see, this device is very flexible in the sense that various diagrams can be studied using the same platform. The, to conclude, the aim of this device is to provide a complete reading solution for visually impaired students as well as a self-learning educational kit to study diagrams which are present in their school textbooks. Thank you.